Okay, if war occurs, will the military abide by the Constitution? Whew, that's a deep question. Um, well, let's not hope for war, because we're actually in a war now. Um, if war occurs, will military abide by the Constitution? Okay, so here's, here's what I'm hearing. And this is from digging in a few sources, to be honest with you. I do have a few sources on this, just conversations. It appears to me that there is a, a large battle with inside the military as we speak. They're not by, say, shooting at each other, but there are factions that um, are supporting the deep state DC model of doing things. Um, but they're exposing themselves, and these are the corrupt generals and base commanders, in my opinion. And then there is, a, a, I believe, a larger faction, believe it or not, of those that are not supporting this. And they believe more in the Constitution and the President Trump model of doing things. And I believe this is going to play out publicly very, very soon. So this is a prediction. I think the military division is going to play out publicly very soon, and this will roll into more disclosures for us. Um, and if you really pay attention to President Trump, you can see it going in that direction. In fact, I'll I'll play a video today that kind of kind of proves the point. So this will be interesting. I think there will be a lot of military that will abide by the Constitution. I do believe that, and it's not my Pollyanna glasses. This is not. It's not my rose-colored way of thinking, I, so I really, really do <clears throat> believe that. And I know there's some great people in the military, and I know there's some commanders that are not very good at all. They're totally deep state, and they both still exist with inside the military from what I can see.